Good morning, folks. Uh, Davis County Judge Executive Al Mattingly here on a, a beautiful November morning. By the way, uh, this afternoon, the rain's going to come in, probably beat most of the leaves that you see on the trees down. It's supposed to get cold. But I'm standing here on the bridge at Panther Creek Park, and this bridge actually goes across its name, the park's namesake, Panther Creek. It was created in around 2000 by former parks director Debbie Zelensky, and this is called Debbie's Dream Catcher. Uh, this bridge is, is in the American Indian folklore. Uh, dream catchers would catch bad dreams, which would disappear in the morning sun. And this is certainly a, a beautiful venue to, to be at on this, this beautiful fall morning. As I look at the uh, Panther Creek, I can see the, the creek, the leaves in the creek, the water flowing down. It's at a very low level because we haven't had a lot of rain lately. The Panther Creek drainage basin is huge in Davis County. And I think it's an appropriate uh, place to have a bridge at Panther Creek Park. One of the things that we're, we want to talk to you this morning about is the maintenance that have been going on in our parks we decided that we needed to do some major upgrades to the park. Uh, maintenance had kind of slid uh, in the past few years, so we put uh, $250,000 into our park system that will be used to, to do some maintenance upgrades. One of those upgrades is this bridge uh, across Panther Creek. We've already done one suspended trail out in the creek bottoms and finished it, kind of use that as a learning experience so that when we get to this bridge, we can do it a lot quicker and faster. If you take a look at the boards, the boards are weathered and cracked. The uh, fencing that protects people from falling into the creek when they come across the trail has gotten slack. So we hope that this will be done by the end of this year. And then next year we will continue as, as we have time to work on the other elevated trails throughout Panther Creek. Not the only thing going on in our other parks. We are doing some upgrades to to our shelters, picnic shelters. Uh, we're doing some uh, upgrades to the parking lots. And as everyone knows, we just uh, went through a, a major overhaul of uh, Horse Fork Creek Park with the installation of a splash pad, uh, a playground for all. And we're just about to open up a, a restroom, a permanent restroom in that park. We have a few other things to still be done there, but, but those upgrades are pretty much it. So if you get a chance, uh, the Friday after Thanksgiving, I would invite you out to Panther Creek Park to go through the light display that all of our guys have been working on actually for the last two months, getting them ready. $5 a car load. Uh, so pack the station wagon, pack the pickup truck, put grandma in her rocking chair, come on out and see a wonderful display, uh, and enjoy the holiday season. If I don't get to talk to you again, uh, have a wonderful Thanksgiving and the rest of the holiday season.